John Haroon Wells' life story is a rich and complex narrative that intertwines his early struggles, his rise to prominence, and the controversies that have shadowed his career. Born on June 24, 1948, in Kalungu, Kenya, Mwao's journey from poverty to power is a testament to his resilience and determination. Early Life and Ambitions Growing up in a humble background, Mwao's early life was marked by poverty. Despite these challenges, he joined the police force in 1968, where he honed his marksmanship skills. His talent in shooting led him to represent Kenya in the 1968 and 1972 Summer Olympics. Political Endeavors Mwao's foray into politics began with the founding of the Party of Independent Candidates of Kenya, PIC. He ran for the presidency in the 1992 Kenyan general election, securing 10,449 votes. His political ambition was further demonstrated when he petitioned the High Court to declare him the sole validly nominated candidate, a case that was ultimately dismissed. In the 2013 general elections, he vied for the Makwini senatorial seat but was defeated by Mutula Kalonzo. Controversial Accusations Mwao's career has been marred by allegations of drug trafficking. In 2011, he was designated by the United States as a narcotic kingpin, leading to sanctions against him. He has been cited as one of the more powerful and active narcotics traffickers in the region by the Director of the Office of Foreign Assets Control of the U.S. Department of Treasury. Mwao has consistently denied these charges, claiming that the United States government was attempting to seize his businesses, estimated to be worth $750 million. Litigations and Legal Battles In response to these accusations, Mwao has engaged in numerous legal battles. He sued the Nation Media Group for an alleged defamatory article implicating him in a tax evasion scandal. He filed suits against senior executives and editors of Kenya's leading media houses to bar them from publishing reports linking him to drug trafficking. He sued the United States Ambassador Michael Ranneberger for associating him with narcotic drug trafficking. He sued a student over a Facebook post linking him to the murder of Internal Security Minister George Saitoti. He sued the author of a report from the International Peace Institute where his designation by the U.S. government as a foreign narcotics kingpin was mentioned. He sued the authors of two blog posts linking him to a businessman believed to be close to Colombia's drug cartels. Business Ventures and Wealth Mwao's business acumen is evident in his various ventures. He was a shareholder in Nakamat, a leading supermarket chain, and reportedly sold his 7.7% stake for $10 million in 2016. His wealth has made him one of the wealthiest individuals in the Okambani region. Legacy and Influence Despite the controversies, Mwao's influence in Kenyan society remains substantial. As a former member of parliament for Kilom constituency and the first director of the defunct Kenya Anti-Corruption Authority, his contributions to Kenyan politics and governance are noteworthy. John Haroon Mwao's life story is a complex narrative of a man who rose from humble beginnings to become a prominent figure in Kenya's political and business landscapes. This is the Nairobi Fame TV, where we bring you the latest, trending and urban news in Nairobi, Kenya and from around the world, subscribe and stay tuned for more.